Can we identify food from the inside? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. I love a good close up. <laughs> but you know who doesn't get enough close ups? Yeah, me. No, our food. When you look really closely at the inside of a piece of food, you get to see how beautiful, layered, and complex it is. Like this example here, Link. Oh, it's the inside of a piece of food? That ain't food, what is, is that? Is that the sky? That is looks that like the, a map. Is that Jupiter? Is, is that, that the clouds? surface of Jupiter? What is that? Is it? It's a filling. Oh, it's, it's a cherry pie! No, she's not. It's, it's a, donut. a jelly donut. <laughs> okay. You see how fun that was? <laughs> so who knows the insides of what goes into their insides the best? This time for Mystery Countdown Theater Inside Food Edition. Just like that, not actually a cherry pie, a jelly donut. Yeah. We're gonna be shown an extreme close up of an image of a food item prepared by the Mythical Kitchen that has been cut in half. Our job is to identify the food before the image completely zooms out. Of course, the faster we click our buzzers and correctly identify the food, the more points we get. And at the end, the loser will get an extreme close up of a food in slow motion. I think I can picture what that's going to be. And since I have won the last three times, Link, this oh, is God. getting boring, I brought my collection of lucky four leaf clovers to keep that winning streak alive. You know about my collection. I've been collecting these since I was a little kid. They're all very precious to me. Oh. Every time I see one, I take it and I put it on this plate. What a coincidence because I, I brought my lucky leaf blower. You know I have a collection of lucky leaf blowers. Oh, cool. Uh, and uh, I definitely brought that today yeah, just yeah. Coincidentally. Well, hopefully it'll work for you. <laughs> Let's play. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a close up. Looks like oh, a petri dish. Shiny. Nine points. Rhett. You, you can't. There's no way. If well, you do, I'm already gonna be angry. I'm going to say cucumber, but I my secondary answer is pickle, which is technically a cucumber, so please. Listen, second, I'm not playing that game. My secondary answer? Yeah, I'm not playing that game today. Yeah, I need one, I need one solid, and now I'm angry. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, pickle. Incorrect. <laughs> what is this? Oh, dang Link. it. I believe it to be a, my primary and secondary answer <laughs> is Kiwi. Yes. <laughs> Correct. Yeah, look at look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. There's it's so complex. The seeds and you know, let's have a jamboree. I'll bring the kiwi. Oh, I see how this is gonna go. <laughs> that rhymes. Mad Dog is going to rhyme with the thing that it is. Look at how the kiwi is perched on like two stilts. It's like got legs. This could be the next Marcel the Shell. Manuel the Kiwi. Huh? How about we, how about we come up with something like Lee the Kiwi or, hey, how about we rhyme with Kiwi? How about Kiana the Kiwi? Andy the Kiwi. Well, you know, we'll workshop it. All right. Yeah. I'm not gonna get confident yet. Oh, gross. What is that? Uh... Link. A Philly cheese steak. Wow, bold. And incorrect. What, there's green. How, uh, Those are green peppers and cheese, man. And onions. Rhett. I believe it is a Big Mac. Correct. <laughs> I believe it is a Look Big Mac. Look at that. What's wrong I with that? I don't give you any slack. If you did not know that was a Big Mac. I don't know if it is a Big Mac. <laughs> it's a, it's the, the face it face. looks like a Big Mac. It, it looks What's like wrong a with Big, that Big Mac, Mac that you got from a restaurant that was trying to make a Big Mac like McDonald's, but it wasn't McDonald's. It was like a place behind McDonald's. You know, that could be a character. Kiana the Big Mac. Yep, yeah, yeah, I'd watch that. <laughs> Gotta right. get Jenny Slate the voice go. it, though. <laughs> oh, this is Harry. Oh, I have a guess, but I'm a little scared. World. What in the world? Red? Um, I believe it is some sort of cabbage. Some sort of. Incorrect. What is this? What is? Uh, Link. What is that? A, a artichoke? Correct. Yeah. That much purple? 
Well, All right, this Lucas. isn't a joke. That's an artichoke. Artichoke's mostly not edible unless you're like a um, an animal with certain types of teeth. Yeah. Well, if if you if you cook it in enough cheese, my man, it's edible. <laughs> my man, <laughs> come on, my man, you're losing. Keep buzzing in first before you can have any clue what this is. This is interesting. Blue and red. What? Oh Blink. gosh. Uh, umaboshi plum. <laughs> I saw seeds. Incorrect. I mean, it's got jello, and that looks like an anus. Rat. Jello anus. Did you say net? Netflix got anus? I said, Is that it, what you said? I said it looks like Jello and it's got an anus. Oh, Netflix got anus. I saw the whole thing and I don't know what it is other than a Jello anus. I will give it to you. It's Jello and I just like that you tacked on anus. Oh, is that like a raspberry? Jello mold. Okay, so it's fruit. What, was that a raspberry? It was a raspberry. A raspberry can look like an anus if you cut it in half. That's Ooh. what we learned today. I'm surprised Lucas didn't mention it. <laughs> he had the opportunity. Does that work the other way around? Uh, mm, I don't know. <laughs> I don't even want to think about what you just said. If you cut your anus in half. Ah! Don't worry, we're still good. I still got half my anus. <laughs> yeah, uh, see, that's how it works. If you, if you don't know, we developed a party game with our friends at Spin Master. They're legit. That makes us more legit. Being at Amazon.com for your purchasability makes it most legit. You play this game with your friends, a party game that laughs in the face of disaster. It's so much fun. We're still good. I, I swear, we're still good. We're still good. We're still good. Do it, come it's on. It's good. You'll be good. Get it, get the game. You'll love it. I'll tell you how to play it, but you don't need to know There's that. directions inside. <laughs> this is a tough one, isn't it? Yeah. This whole thing. I don't, I don't look at my food, I just eat it. What? Link. <sighs> noodle soup of the chicken. Chicken Correct. noodles. Correct. Yes. Is that spiral noodles? Look at those. Uh, uh, technically. Oh. That's chicken noodle soup. I was going to say that wasn't technically uh, cut in half until Lucas proved me wrong. <laughs> Again. Look at that. He cut the can in half. You cut the can in half? He cut the can in half. But you took it out and cut the can in half and put it back in, didn't you? Didn't you, Lucas? No. I saw that there were some noodles that were cut in half. Man, that close up of that chicken made me not want to eat the chicken. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, my boy. What did I don't, say before? Don't you my man. Yeah, I, don't take me from my man to my boy. My, my, you, you can start with my boy and then go to my man. My cousin. I'm not your cousin. <laughs> my friends. I got. I'm got to dig out of a little hole here. Oh, there's a hole. Dig out of it. <laughs> what is this? Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Rat. What that is a clove of garlic? Correct. How did you know that? Because I've I've cut. Oh, it's cut. I keep forgetting it's cut in half. <laughs> it's garlic. It's garlic. Hey, uh, hey, Lucas. Hold uh, on. That's not a clove of garlic. That's like eighteen cloves of garlic. What is that? I mean, technically, it's a head of garlic. Uh, you know, yeah, it's a head of garlic containing many cloves. Half okay. Point. Do you want the point? Okay. Do you do? Okay. You're gonna take the point. Is that how you want to play the game? You want to do that? You want to take the point? You want to take the point? No, I don't want to take the point. I just don't want to give you, you all the point? point. I mean, is it a clove of garlic? Well, I thought that that was the name of. I, I understand what. You, yeah, the whole the thing, the head of garlic. No, I'm gonna give. I'm gonna give it to you. You know what I mean? I knew it was garlic, but but I got to keep you on your toes. Oh, that looks, that looks good. I'm taking a chance. Red. Honeycomb. Incorrect. That's a good <laughs> guess, dude. That's a freaking good guess. You know, I just, I had to, I I had to go for more. something. It looks like a cobbler to me. Oh. Blink. Carrot cake. Wow. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. yeah, I. that's the part of the carrot cake. When I eat it, I do mm. get that close mm. to it. I knew it. I knew like it. Like the cream it, cheese right. layer, and it's like, there. Oh, is there actual carrots in this? Oh man, you can't beat a good carrot cake. I have an idea for a new animal. It's called a ferret snake, but that's just a carrot cake. Okay, that was more creative. Thank you. A ferret snake. So what part of it is ferret? What part of it is snake? Straight down the middle. 
Oh, yeah. Stra- yeah. one half snake, one half. One half snake, one half ferret. Ah, uh, yeah. that's awkward. There's another hole. See, what is that? Link. It's a clam. It's a clam. <laughs> you guessing for me? <laughs> no, I mean, saying that's what it looks like. I know it's not. All right. Uh, it's lasagna, dude. Oh, shoot, it is. When I eat lasagna, I get that close to it. Dang. Oh, shoot, it is. It looked like I had a Dang. mouth. Dang. I think I need to look at my food He's more. a lasagna. No, I can't do that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Lucas is canceled. <laughs> there you saw it. It happened. You want to end it right here? Do you want to give up? You want to forfeit? You want to do one of those? 11. Uh, you, oh, you, what's it called? A pity? Oh, you're gonna you're gonna taunt now? A pity? Uh, you're gonna look really bad if you lose if, when you taunted at round nine. Never happened. It's never happened. I've never gotten overconfident and lost this in the end, Mister Three Times in a Row. Oh gosh! You better buzz in now, man. I got nothing. They all are like petri dishes to me. What? Right. Apple pie. I've thought apple pie and like. Half half all of, of them. Yeah, for some reason. Incorrect. Uh, whoa! What Link. in the world? This is a, uh, Almond Joy's got nuts. Mounds don't, Almond Joy. Wow, that's a cross section of well, Almond Joy. Yeah. That's incredible. I was, I was told not scary. to accept anything that's else. That's an Almond Joy. Well, yeah, it wouldn't be Mounds. No rhyme? Well, it says, it says not accepted. Any other candy bar. Like, that's a very specific. Oh, yeah, yeah. And yeah. you had to recite the uh, the jingle to yourself. I don't know. I'm impressed. Yeah. You're talk- you thinking about extra points, aren't you? <laughs> Is that what you're doing? Okay. You yeah. over there. I'm down by 13. So what you, number? You scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. Now, whenever this happens. Not to, literally. Not that this, this situation. You've never been in this situation that I'm in right now, of course. But when you are hypothetically in this situation, what I typically might think about. Oh, doing I, I know what you say. So you, you know get what? It by this certain number, you know what? You can get thirteen points. You know what? You know what, Rhett? I'm such a you know. I want you to make be, it make it believable. I want you to be. I want you to be engaged in this. Make it believable. I, I don't want you to. You, you seem like you don't care anymore. It's like let's make this interesting. Let's make this interesting. I probably wouldn't have said that much. If you get this one by nine points, okay, or ten points. Nine, will, or, nine or above. I will that, actually give you 14 points. That seem, oh, that seems fair. <laughs> you can do it, man. Right. <clears throat> this is the last one. You take it to the psychology of what could it be? <laughs> oh my gosh. It's just whiteness. Uh, I'm going to say a s'more. People are, people. I was going to say marshmallow, but I was like, they wouldn't just do a marshmallow. I'm going s'more for the win. Right. Incorrect. Okay. Link. Oh man, there's. It's a, it's a, white chocolate macadamia cookie from Subway. <laughs> I saw the very specific. Incorrect. See, I gave you another chance to redeem yourself. Rocky Road ice cream. Yes, you got it. Is that okay? Well, which inc- incidentally points. has the same ingredients as s'mores. Rocky of. Road ice cream. Oh, you can so you can keep that, Lucas. Lu- Lucas abandoned the the rhyme scheme. Yeah, you can, well, you can't put him in a he, box. He started doing other stuff. It was really if you, well. If you put Lucas in a box, he'll cut it in half and get right out of it. All right. So you know what? You tried hard. Uh, the loser. But you got You eat your saved. food so fast. You don't. Yeah, I haven't been looking at my food. I gotta look at my food to you, prepare for this. You get an time. extreme close up of a food and um, slow a slow mo extreme close up. It's a it's a hard boiled egg. Disappeared. Hard boiled egg. It disappeared. <laughs> I think that was like one of the best moments we've ever had. Thanks for subscribing and licking that bell. <laughs> <laughs> was that a Freudian slip? 
<laughs> I think we should start licking the mail. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Amanda, and this little mythical beast and I are having a mystery countdown theater marathon. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. That's a happy boy. And <laughs> they look just alike. Click the top link to watch us figure out what everyday items should be made out of food. How about a phone case? And good mythical more. And find out what it went about the guy they're gonna land. Get some friends together and pick up our party game. We're still good from Amazon.com.